Bro, what would you do uh, if you heard someone screaming for help? Guys, what the f- You hear that? I don't know if I'll help, like try and like investigate the source of the noise. Why? So in early September 2017, 31-year-old Laura Wallen was reported missing after she did not report for work. A search began, but still, there was no news of her. She was also four months pregnant. Her boyfriend, Tyler Tessier, appeared at a press conference on TV with Laura's parents, tearfully <laughs> pleading for a safe return. However, the police suspected that Tyler may have been involved with Laura's disappearance. Due to the incontrolled consistencies in information that he provided to them. On the night of the disappearance, Laura had messaged her sister, mentioning that Tyler was taking her on an adventure but she did not know where and that she was in some open field. So the police traced the last transaction made on Laura's debit card to a grocery store near her home and linked the information together. And two days after the press conference, the police searched the perimeter of a wooded area in Damascus. And with the help of cadaver dogs, they found Laura's body buried in a shallow grave. So autopsy later revealed that she was shot once in the back of her head. So police discovered that Tyler was actually in a relationship with another woman and even arranged to marry the other woman a month after the date that Laura was due to give birth. <laughs> Messed up eh? However, Laura found out what Tyler has been up to and sent a text message to the other woman to meet up to explain the situation. But then Tyler convinced the other woman that Laura is crazy and stopped him. And when the other woman told Tyler about a text message, he replied her, I could literally kill her. Like he said that on text. It's evidence why. So police believe that he brought Laura to the remote location with the intention to silence her. So of course, Tyler was then arrested and charged with first degree murder. Unfortunately, Tyler committed suicide just hours before his trial. So the truth behind why he killed Laura was never confirmed and he was never put to justice. That's not fair. Now comes the scary part. So the YouTubers Sam and Kobe released a ghost hunting video where they went to explore an abandoned insane asylum and a woman's scream could be heard in the background at one point. Guys, what the f- You hear that? Get out of here! Go! At first, they thought it was something supernatural and decided to quickly leave the place. But actually, it was Laura Wallen's cries for help from the open field nearby. That's, oh, that's, that's messed up, man. Eh. Sad, right? They thought, like, oh, ghost, ghost, oh, they're never going to investigate. Like, I think by default, we should never ignore a cry for help. Like, if you need to, just go and, like, take a look and see what's going on. If there's nothing and you deem it fine, if there's no follow-ups, then, you know, it's good. But otherwise, just go and check it out and make sure everything's okay, lah.